the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello, Gamer Nom is back. So for today's video, I am going to talk to you about this guy, Master Toad, the strongest ground unit and the latest update of anime, no, not anime fighting simulator, but all-star tower defense. Sorry about that. So before we unlock that unit, let's get the gems first and capsule corp. Spoiler alert, we have 12,000 gems here. There you go. Time to unlock this unit. Guys, do you agree this is the strongest ground unit in this update? I think yes. How about the whole game so far? Is this the strongest? Not that one. This one. Toadmaster, Mega Rare. Let's upgrade it. Give you an idea. Let's compare it to a level 18 Nihok. So we have here level 18 Nihok. Level 72 Toadmaster Jiraiya. Okay. Level 1 Nihok has 179 damage. Now upgrade it to upgrade 1, 313. Let's upgrade Toadmaster, 410. And guys, I only used like $500. To upgrade Mio to level upgrade 2, you need like, how much is that? 3,000? 4,000? I don't remember. But 4, Toadmaster, just 500 guys. See that? 500, the damage is so far. Just basing it on how much you need to upgrade it. Now max upgrade, you have 600 damage for the max upgrade. A Toadmaster, we will be having, I think that's 6,000 plus damage. That's so high. Times 10 comparing it to Miyok. But again, guys, uh, Miyok is a different unit. Just comparing how far the damage is. Not discrediting Miyok or what, but Toadmaster is so strong. I think they're gonna nerf this uh, unit. Okay, so now let's test Toadmaster. I think I'm gonna finish the Psychic City. The boss, we're gonna defeat the boss. I since this update, I just played this yesterday. I was I was able to finish like three story modes. I mean, yeah, three stories so far. Now I'm in the Psychic City. Let's defeat the boss. This is the first time that I'm gonna fight this. And I am quite confident we're gonna beat this, okay? So I'm gonna show you also a guide. We're using Bulma and one. Air unit, this one, use of this is my favorite one, use of. Okay, so we're gonna put it here because this is where the unit starts to decelerate. There you go. I usually check the HP of the mobs. So as you can see here, uh, let upgrade one. Let's check the HP 100 plus. Okay, so we can still withstand this wave so far. Okay, 234. So, in this part of the game, I'm starting to decide whether I'm going to like uh, get a Bulma or or upgrade this guy. So, but the main main uh, goal is to get a Bulma as as early as possible because we need money, right? Oops, oops, oops. Okay, I think I miscalculated it. Okay, so in this situation, guys, I can just uh, clear the wave to get extra money to drop. Use of but yeah, I'll let it slip to 2 HP, 2 damage to our main base, so not a problem. Okay, there we go. So I think we can upgrade this now. If we upgrade this, our damage will increase by 196. Okay, there we go. Check that out, guys. One hit, one hit, I mean, one hit, one hitting the uh, enemy units. Next up, if we upgrade, we will be having the condensed energy, right? So this cotton. Is this a cotton for Naruto fans? So this will be changed to, yeah. Let's check it out. I'm gonna show you. I think a Rasengan. Condensed energy, yes, Rasengan. As you can see, we're one hitting enemies, which is good, as, as well as upgrading Bulma. We have 6 so far. Guys, I did not uh, turn on the auto skip of the waves because I, I tried it on the previous levels and I lost. I'm just making sure that we win this one. Oh, there, there you go. We have money now. Upgrading it. Now I'm starting to like uh, increase my air defense because there are 
enemy air units and as we all know Toadmaster cannot hit this units this is only a ground unit next up after the condensed energy upgrade 4 will change the condensed energy into geyser's wheel so it's a combination of the cotton and the rasengan and check the damage it will increase by is that 2000 there you go this is the condensed wheel see that rasengan has fire in it it's a combination i guess so we are already at wave 8 I see, again i can defeat this without bulma but i just pre prefer bulma because more uh, cash in this game means your units more units more chances of winning okay approaching wave 9 we already have a max toad master with a damage of 7000 guys this is a level 80 toad master 7000 we can deploy another one max max level it there you go there you go so, wave 11 so I'm targeting with this unit the strongest unit so that we will uh, defeat the, those clones uh, if you're playing the game you know the clones I want to destroy that as much as possible before it reaches our first unit next up the weakest we're gonna put on the weak one uh, another toad master this is the fourth so again uh, comment it on the comment section if my video is so fast so I don't really uh, prefer long videos so far we have four toadmasters there you go two uh, usops so we are in wave 15 there you go okay so I think we're gonna defeat this air units. okay so Wave 15, we can sell our air, all our air units. We're gonna add one more here just to make sure to defeat the boss. But I don't uh, sell Usopp even though we don't have air units at the end of the game. Just to make sure if, if some, this one, this decelerators at the end wave, 15th wave are kinda tanky, really tanky guys. So I kinda panic here, this part, because the enemies are starting to like uh, move farther. There you go. So, yeah. These units are kind of tanky. As you can see, my focus is not on the boss because I'm sure that we're gonna defeat the boss, but the main problem is here. These units here. There you go. The boss has already spawned. There you go. Oh, oh. This will be a close one, guys. Again, comment it on the comment section if I need to like slow down for you to learn from this strategy or if you have a better strategy, comment it on the comment section. Okay, we're able to defeat that. Now, time to defeat the boss. Additional tip, guys. If if your, your, uh, I guess your units, this is this one, is out of range, just sell it and create another one to maximize it. There you go. Oh, by the way, I sold the Bulma if you're not aware. There you go. So it's finished. As a reward, we're gonna claim the CEO. Blah blah. There you go. Again, Toad Master, the strongest ground unit. What are your thoughts? Comment it on the comment section. You want me to post more videos about this game? Comment it on the comment section. Okay? So that would be it. I hope that you learned something and enjoyed this video. This is GamerNom and GamerNom out.